expanding. It meant previously the universe was smaller. Rewind the clock far enough back, and it appeared as if there was a point when our entire universe began. towards a moment of creation. But many scientists were not convinced by this apparent Big Bang. It seemed like a leap too far. But there was one piece of evidence that had the power to convince everyone. part of the cosmos should now be filled with this light. And it turned out it was. It just happened to be in a rather unusual form. As unlikely as it sounds, the relic of the Big Bang fireball was actually visible on television. Let me explain how this is possible. Imagine this balloon is our universe. Here it is, just a few hundred thousand years old. At this point, something very strange happens because the universe suddenly becomes transparent to visible light as atoms form. It's as though a fog has lifted and light is suddenly able to travel freely through the universe. every point in space, photons began to travel unimpeded and the entire universe is filled with a blinding light. But this light, released in the hot turmoil of the early universe, didn't stay bright forever. As space expanded, it stretched through the spectrum from visible light down into microwaves. And it's these microwaves that get picked up by television aerials. Incredibly, almost 1% of this static is the afterglow of creation itself. It's the stretched out remnants of the very earliest light in the universe. <laughs> 